Hey guys, Jamie back with part 4 of my playthrough of Amnesia the Dark Ascent. Last time me and my friend had left off in a uh, part of the mansion with a bunch of wine barrels with a monster in our midst. So, just gonna get right into it. Hopefully I don't scare the crap out of myself and just hide it in the corner somewhere. sleep that well last night at all. Didn't sleep well at all. Got about a good two to three hours of sleep at most. So this should be even better. Sleep deprived video game <laughs> choreographer. Oh. It's been more than a month since my last entry. After the event inside the underground chamber in Algeria, Professor Herbert insisted I return to England. He said he didn't want to risk forfeiting the entire expedition lest I took a turn for the worse. Oh, that's awesome. An excessive decision, in retrospect. Yes. But I'm glad it turned out that way. Okay. I found my journal this morning in the haphazard collection of things brought home from Africa. Next to it lay the broken stone orb wrapped in cloth. I tried to assemble it, but couldn't. The pieces wouldn't fit together, as if they weren't from the same object. Could I have imagined it all? Perhaps. Is there ever a complete orb? I don't know. Alright, where did I come in? I came in... Where did I come in last time? Over here. 
Okay, are you hiding anything from me? Huh? No, I'm not hiding anything. You can just, you know, leave me back if you want, or you can just spin me around, do stuff. Just gotta lead him. What is that horrid noise? Even though it was intended for my journey to Africa, this must be something very important. I just know it. I've taken it upon myself to piece the orb back together, but it's been more difficult than one might think. The pieces are behaving strangely. They seem to change color, shape, and texture, but Ooh. ever so slightly. Like silly putty. Yesterday, I took careful measurements and notated any significant markings. Today, I confirmed my suspicions. They were changing. Uh -oh. I was terrified and rushed off to see the finest geologist in London, Sir William Smith. I approached the subject with care and we discussed how rocks change form. He told me about the nature of glass, how it eventually collapses on itself like ice slowly melting over the course of centuries. Smith eased my mind a bit, but I can't escape the feeling that these shards have otherworldly properties. Yeah, same here. Really don't want to go in this room, but I have to. I left Jeffrey out there. <laughs> you will avenge Jeffrey. I will avenge Jeffrey. Okay. Now I'm just gonna bash your head in. Open a bit. Shut you. Stop grinding, jeez, God. Five left, not bad. Ooh, sanding. Block. A whittling block, actually. Okay, anything? Oh, tinder box! Can I, can, I, can I pick you up? Can I? Okay. Let's see if I can get this. Let's see what's closer. There we go, tinder box! Heck yeah! Anything behind you, barrels? Are you hiding anything from me? No. I'm just gonna go into the corner and die. 
Okay, good to know. Barrel. Chains in the roof. Uh. Getting closer. Somehow. Why are you crying? Tell me! 
me or I'll show you what Jeffrey likes to do. With freaky little babies. I'm at a loss right now. Like, what the heck am I supposed to do? Jeffrey's in here now. He's awesome. He's gonna protect me. But what am I supposed to do? You think? You know, bottle. What am I? You know, he's gonna throw you at the wall. You just close the door, okay? You go. You, you go, bottle. Jeffrey. monster, but there wasn't there, it's just, wow, I'm almost out of tinderboxes, I should probably stop blading and stuff. Let's go search for it a bit. Tinderbox! Yes. Get free, your younger brother shall help us.
Okay, the barrel's hiding stuff. Yeah, actually it was hiding stuff. But I can't get to it. And I certainly can't pick it up. Barrel. Ah, no, it hit me in the face. In the box. Yeah. stuff is it's so it, it's somewhere you'll you'll find it thank you bye yeah it's probably gonna be a bad idea if you stay there I just go and join your buddies in this room yay slide Master that dropped it. Such a nice guy. Though his face looks like crap. And, like, I ran him over multiple times. I probably did run him over multiple times. That's why he and his friends don't like me. Very much. Oh, I should have used the rest room before. The rest room before I went and played this. Oh, God. Just gotta have to tough it up. Tough it up, man. There has to be something in this room that I can use. Is there anything I can use? Oh, for a second I look like a little head. Maybe I can pull like one of these boxes over and I can just jump and detach it. Ah! 
missed Jeffrey already. guys hope you enjoyed watching me freak out over no monsters at all and uh, if you like the video uh, remember to comment and subscribe and show to your friends and give it a like in the uh, event that you actually liked it okay uh, I gotta stop saying uh, have a good one guys Jamie out be sure to keep checking for part 5 the cellar archives.